travel situation this morning and on the tube there's a good service on all lines as you can see there on the board but the DLR is suspended between Deptford Bridge and Lewisham that's because of flooding. Now that flooding uh, from heavy rain is also causing problems on the roads that's the A20 there. Lone Pit Vale is closed in both directions between the A21 and Thurston Road. Two lanes are closed on the A40 Westway westbound at the Paddington Slip. That's also because of the flooding from the heavy rain overnight. In Greenwich, traffic is queuing on the A102 northbound from Blackwall Lane to Blackwall Tunnel. And the M25, anti-clockwise, has one lane blocked at Junction 26 for Waltham Abbey. Right, let's get a check on the weather now with Kate Kinsella. Good morning. It's a rather damp and humid start to the day. We had rain overnight and there's further rain to come. The Met Office has a yellow weather warning in place for further heavy downpours. We could hear rumbles of thunder mixed into them and also we may get one or two spots of localised flooding. Bit of mist and murk around this morning as well, but that will lift. We will get one or two dry spells between the showers as well and into the afternoon. We could even see a little bit of sunshine, but that in itself could spark off another shower. But the temperature is still warm. The maximum between 19 and 21 Celsius, so still feeling reasonably pleasant, especially in that warm sunshine. Overnight tonight, further showers to come. Again, one or two of those could be quite heavy. We may hear a rumble or two of thunder. Slowly but surely though they will become fewer and further between, drying out as we head through to Thursday. Minimum temperature again not dropping down too far quite a warm night, 13 14 Celsius as the minimum temperature. So for tomorrow there is a bit of cloud but we should see some decent spells of sunshine. Temperature reasonable as well 23 Celsius. Still the chance of maybe a shower. Temperatures slowly start to cool as we head into Friday but still not too bad. But then that northerly breeze takes hold for the weekend and things turning a bit colder. Well, that's it. I'll be back in half an hour. But of course, you can keep up to date on our website. Bye for now.